What up, what up, what up? You guys are probably like, Dove Springs 45, Man 09, number one? Nah, nope, nope, nope. There's a story behind this. I actually made this account to mess with my friends. Um, One of my friends actually, one of my friends actually was always getting beat by Dove Springs and Man 09. Wait a second, hold up. Don't, that was my offensive autos behind the scenes. So, shh, don't tell nobody. Don't tell nobody and don't when you hate when Devin Hester gets in the open field and scores on you first possession. I was so frustrated. But anyways, yeah, I made this count to mess with my friend. He didn't fall for it, so I decided to play a game on it. I won and I kept winning on this count. So I decided to stay on it till I lose or if I keep winning until I get in the top 100 or whatever. Maybe some other people would think it's the Man 09 user. So here we go. And I'm in the open field, and I just thought I would score there. And then he brings his safety over. I think it was his safety over for the stop. And this run scheme actually worked pretty good in the outcome of the game. But I was not getting that many yards, really. Um, some people, I tear this scheme really tears them up, and some I can't. I get the separation for and hit Olsen there. But it was helping my passing game by running this. And I had the hole there, and I just could not squeeze through. And I get outside. Stewart is into the... Nope, he's out the one. <laughs> I was hoping I'd get in there. And then I go with the easy fullback dive and get it in for the score. All right, so here we go. Do not run play action versus me. Do not run play action versus me. I will sack you. All right. So I get that pick, and I thought if he makes a mistake on first possession, he's going to be making mistakes all game. Unfortunately, that now was not the case, and this guy was at least top 200, maybe bottom top 100. Um, he was a good opponent. I could tell by the skill points. Um, that's how I knew where he would be ranked. And so he's tossing the, I'm tossing the ball outside, trying to score, and I get to the one. And look at that goal line D. Let's see that again. Look at this goal line D. That's when you know he's a, you know, I, that might even been field goal block. But that actually works on runs up the middle. So it was good D by him. Actually, it might not have been. Now that I look at his other defense, I'm not sure. But I try to pass outside. It can't get it. And then I run with that draw. And I thought I was out. I thought I wasn't going to get it. But then I leaned in. Once I saw him leaning for it, I knew it was I knew it was in. All right, so there we go. He's leaning forward. He goes for the QB sneak. I don't know why I really did that. I would go deep and then try to go for the QB sneak. But um, he has plenty of time. He's been fit into tight holes all game. That was that was frustrating, too. These tight holes he was fitting it in. And right there, I thought I had the pick, but John Beeson couldn't get far enough downfield to pick that ball off. And right here, I thought it looked like I almost had the pick, but I was a little behind him. Let's look at that again. It's, it fools your eyes. It looks like I had the pick, but I was behind him. I should have had the pick. I should have pulled myself in front. But look right here. Looks like I have it, but I'm really behind him. And he gets himself to the two-yard line and goes outside. And I knew he was going outside. I had a feeling. I was trying to audible my defense. Didn't have time. And he scores. So I'm trying to go deep. I really should have tried just waste clock. I should not have tried to push the ball downfield, but I did. You know, just my determination, my motivation to score. And it doesn't go too well for me. That could have been a pick. I got to punt it away. And you know Devin Hester already took it back once on me. He gets the ball. And you know what Devin does. He does it again on me. Gets an open field. No, nah, I'm just kidding, guys. He stops me. Or I stop him. And so here we go. He's got the ball and he needs to get some type of score. And those screens are not going to work. He tried to run those all game and they weren't working. So there we go. He's getting the field goal. So it's a three-point game at half. Um, so that's not too bad. Um, and I get the ball too. So even though I wasn't getting yards, I was still running the ball. And it was still, like I said, helping my game. And look at Geddes getting that separation and Francis is way into the end zone. There we go. That's how we do it. <laughs> All right, so we got a four-point lead, and he's got the ball. Trying to run the screen again, and Hester almost got around. Um, but if I would have hit him, he would have been behind the line. I would have tried to force a fumble and whatnot. 
So he was running a good offense versus my uh, fag D um, that has been working for me. He threw one pick and then was able to adjust and not make many other mistakes. And usually with this fag D, I get a couple picks a game. Um, this game only got one, though. He was just fitting in into tight holes, throwing real accurate passes. Cutler was real accurate this game, which was a surprise to me because lots of times he's not as accurate as he, as um this game at least. And this is a really good matchup, Panthers Bears, because they're both really good Madden teams. And third down, and I run the draw and get it. So I'm still running the ball, and I could have gotten outside. I should have gotten outside. Just that one block just did not hold. It was pretty unfortunate. But, you know, I'm just trying to get um, get ahead and win this game and get out of here, you know. It was kind of late at night when I was playing this game. And I just wanted to go to bed. And look at Jeremy Shockey to the 10, to the 5. And he is hurt. <laughs> I, I really like Jeremy Shockey. It was kind of unfortunate. Um, but I try to toss it outside. And my tosses really were not working. Usually I get um, a couple big runs off that a game. I might have only gotten one 10-yard run off of it. And I'm running this uh, this full house formation. And here we go. I get a field goal. I was really hoping to score there, but wasn't able to do it. And you know if I'm showing a kickoff, it's only something good or something bad. And fortunately, it is something good for me. I get the fumble. This game's over. Thanks for watching. I knew I could come through. Eventually, something bad would happen for him, and he fumbled. And I'm just kidding, guys. It is overturned here. <laughs> I was hoping uh, the game was over then, but I knew I knew he didn't fumble. I was trying to pick a play quick, so he couldn't challenge, but he did. All right, so he's running the ball, and he just now started running the ball on me. Really, he didn't do that before, and it was really working. It was a nice, uh, it was a nice run. Uh, he had a nice running game. Um, or maybe just because I wasn't ready for it, which really probably was the case. Because I do have a good run D. Um, and I wasn't really running it in this game uh, much. I think I might have ran it once. Some people might think that's my run D. No, that was just something I was trying out. Um, it works up the middle, but does not work on the outside, as you see right there. So and I got about a minute 53 right there to score. And I wanted to run the full house and uh, the Snugs flip um, in this in this uh, last possession. So that's what I did. I was running full house. Now I go to Snugs flip. I get the separation, Smith, Steve Smith, Beast gets outside, now I try to go deep, and look at that, he could have had the pick, I was so scared, right when I threw it, I thought it was a pick, I thought the game was over, but it wasn't, so I'm running, this full house is working, Olsen's beasting it up, and what the, I did not pick that play, I don't even know what happened there, I thought it was a glitch or something, but I was mad and come back with the face throw and get it to the two yard line. And I said I was going to score. I knew I was going to score. And I don't score on that play. So I was like, I'm going to score on this play. No problem. And I still do not score. I thought I was in there, though. I did think I was in. And this is some good goal ID. Not. <laughs> no, no, no. He's not going to do that to me again. He's not going to stop me. No, he will not stop me on that QB sneak. <laughs> All right, so... No, nah, he couldn't do anything. We're going into OT. Oh, yes. And I knew I was going to get the toss. Coin toss and OT is always the same. It's the beginning of the game, and I saw there was no cornerback on the left side of the field. I hit him, and he is the 30, the 20, 10, 5, and he is high-stepping into the end zone. It's a win. It's a win. It is a win. Yes, people, I pulled it off. That was crazy. Cam Newton should be on the cover of Madden 2013. Cam 13. Newton cover of Madden 2013. That should freestyle for a whole, whole video. Maybe whole in video. the next one. Maybe for a whole live com. com. <laughs> Maybe I should. No, no. I should. I'm going to try it. Don't I'm do try it. To it. Us. Someday I will try to freestyle a whole video. Maybe do a not, whole online no, ranked match try. and post it. Do not try. Just a thought. No, and look at the thought. separation. Not even. That's why you look and read the field. I saw no one was there. I knew it was over right then. Thanks for watching. Peace. I love you guys.